as envisaged in terms of section 115 of the criminal procedure. After all the hype, one of the most highly anticipated court cases in recent times was finally underway. The Oscar Pistorius murder trial has captured the world's imagination, and Judge Tokazili Masipa asked how the Paralympic athlete pleaded to the four charges against him, including that of the most serious charge of murdering his girlfriend, Reva Steenkamp. Do you understand the charges, Mr. Pistorius? I do, I do, my lady. How do you plead? Not guilty, my lady. Pistorius's lawyer, Kenny Oldwich, then read out Oscar's plea explanation. In it, they attacked the state's version of events, and in particular, that witnesses claim there was arguing in the moments before the shooting. I deny this allegation and reiterate that there is no justification, whether legally or factually, for this unfair and incorrect allegation to have been made. The aforesaid allegation is also not supported by any of the statements disclosed to me by the state. But the prosecution, Phil, Pistorius, has a much more serious case to answer. Lady, we argue that the accused version during the bail application and today is, cannot be reasonably possibly true, should be rejected, and as the only inference from the circumstantial evidence would be that the accused shot and killed the deceased with direct intent to kill. The state then called their first witness. Michelle Berger, who lives 177 metres away in a nearby estate, said she heard screams at around 3 a.m. on the morning of the incident. It was a climax. It, the, it was, she was very scared. It was screams that was a climax. And then gunshots. Bang. Bang, bang, bang. There was a greater, there was a, a longer pause between number one and two than between number two and three and three and four. But in cross-examination, Barry Rue, Oscar Pistorius' senior counsel, questioned Michelle Berger's testimony. Was there one scream or many? And was the banging sound that she heard, could that have been a cricket bat bashing down the door? But Miss Berger claims that was not the case. She heard the screams and then the gunshots. The trial continues. Dan Williams, CCTV, Pretoria.